Good afternoon everyone, my name is Whitney Munnan, technical agronomist for Channel Seed here in southern Indiana and Kentucky and today I'm in western Kentucky and I'm hoping to show you a little bit of a tip and a trick on how to know if your corn is ready to be sprayed with fungicide. Every single year I get calls and questions, Whitney is it time to spray my corn? So let me help you evaluate and see if your corn is ready to spray. Normally, when we're talking about making a full season foliar uh, application of fungicide, we're really targeting that BT R1 timeframe. BT is when we have a fully expanded tassel in the field, and that R1 is when we see those first signs of exposed green silks. So here's how you know if you're getting close to that timing in your field. So we call this the leaf unrolling method. So what you're gonna do out in the field is you're gonna walk out in the field and you're gonna look for the highest, most expanded leaf collar in your whorl. Then you pull those leaves straight out of the whorl. Then we're gonna do this leaf unrolling method, okay? So we simply unroll the leaves from the whorl. And what we're trying to do is see how many more leaves does that corn plant have to push out before we get to that tasseling time period. Four leaves. Five. Six and seven. The money shot right here at our tassel. So you can see I already have one that I've unrolled uh, before. And this one had one, two, three, four, five five true leaves still to go before that tassel was going to be out and fully expanded. Now given the GDUs we're accumulating right now, we could expect three days potentially for each new leaf to come out. So we could be looking at anywhere from 12 to 15 days potentially before this field is ready to be sprayed with fungicide. So thanks for joining us for an agronomy break. 